Master of the day, Mr. K.B. Jani, fellow Toastmasters and invited guest. Before I open my life book in front of you, I have a question for you. How many of you have seen the movie Sachin A Brilliant Dream? Just raise your hand. Okay. M.S. Dhoni. How many of you? Okay. Fantastic. Now, tell me one thing. If the movie has to be made on your life so far, what should be the title of the movie? Give a serious thought of this question because it's all about your achievements so far. I have already decided for me at least. The movie will be directed by none other than Mr. Raju Hirani. And the title of the movie would be Fourth Idiot, Now Number. Leave to the world and acute listener to the heart. Why I am saying so, that will come in my uh, life book when I uh, you know, turn the pages. Before that, let me just give you some brief about my how I started my life. The first cry began in the Masana Civil Hospital 38 years before on 23rd July 1979. Basically, I am an Ahmedabad. I belong to a very rich family of Ahmedabad, one of the richest family of Ahmedabad. And please make no mistake by considering this richness with the financial worth. I am talking here the richness in terms of love, compassion, sympathy, <coughs> empathy, and support. So in that way, I belong to the richest family of the uh, Ahmedabad. <coughs> Life was fun till uh, 12th science standard result. After that, you know, it went upside down because I scored miserably low, 53 percentage only, because I went against the decision of my science teacher who wanted me to opt for commerce, but I did not. I did not listen to him because, you know, I am big for the world. So, you know, with his glorified persona, he appeared before me, smile on his face, in a smile, that, see, I told you, you are not a science material, but still, in spite of my clear instructions, you opted for science and you failed. Now, you idiot, you listen to me and you go for BSc. But here is a problem. My parents wanted to see me as an engineer and that was the dream I was also seeing from my childhood. Even though I was not clear what the engineer means. I was thinking that engineer must be something who is driving the engine of railway. <laughs> till, till standard six. You know, I was always wondering that why my parents want me to do this silly job. But anyhow, it took some time to clear the doubts. After that, I decided to do the diploma of mechanical based on 10th and 10th standard results. My mother was confused. Then what will people say? After 12th science, now you are going for a 10th standard uh, course. But at that day, my father told me a powerful sentence. At that day, my father told me something which changed my life. In that day, on that day, my father changed the direction of my life. My father told me, Sabse bada rog, kya kahenge lo? In English, people, what will people think that is the biggest disease is happening in this world and it has killed thousands of innovation. Thousands of inventors could not try it because of this uh, disease. Sabse bada rog, kya kahenge lo? And I decided to follow my father's instructions and I opted for diploma studies. After that, again I was standing in the queue for my third year direct uh, B admission, straight to the third year, there is a system for that. Unfortunately, or maybe fortunately, the God sitting up there loves to play with me. And I missed the admission again for lack of only one mark. The person next to me secured the admission and I was left with pay payment, sheet, payment sheet option. So again, you know, I looked at my father. My father was also looking at me. So gathering all his courage, he told me to secure the admission, but I know the pockets were not very deep. So I left the admission and I decided that I will go for the part-time studies. My, my friends were also telling me that you are an idiot. You missed the lifetime opportunity. You have had a struggle in your life. But I said, nothing doing. I will go for part-time uh, part studies. Four years continuously, evening, six to nine, nine to five job, six to nine college. In 2005, I became a graduate mechanical engineer. My 12th standard friends became graduate engineers on in the year of 2000. And for the same degree, I had to invest or invest maybe five years more. And I became the engineer in 2005. Why I am saying so? If I look back today and I compare my position with respect to the, my friends, I can see that I am in a much more better position to compare to them. And I also realized that to understand 
the calculation of God, you need minimum five to seven years. It is nothing immediate. And all potential, everything is inside us. And to explain it in more simpler way, I would like to quote a Doha of Kabir, which says that, Jo tilmahi tel hai, jo chakmat mein aag, jo tilmahi tel hai, jo chakmat mein aag, tera sahi tuj mein hai, jag sake to jag. It says that, like a cement has a seed in, uh, oil in it, like a stone has a fire in it, maybe he is, he is not aware about it, like that all potential, everything is inside you. It is a matter of self-awakening. So my friend, I take this opportunity to uh, urge you, do not listen to the world. Be a deaf to the world and follow your heart and chase your dream. Over to you, Postmaster. Thank you.